All right, just a quick note that this video is from like October of 2021, so it is from a while back, but I thought that you'd still enjoy watching it anyway. See you soon. Hello. Hello. Oh. It's Journey. Hey. It is currently 11.30 and I have just woken up from the biggest nap because I thought it was the bright idea to not go to sleep before boarding my flight today because my flight was at around 6.30 and the shuttle was coming to pick me up at around 4.30, so I thought it'd be fun to pull an all-nighter to try to stay up, which is what I did. And as soon as I landed here, I felt so tired. So I've just been sleeping, but now it is about time to go out for lunch with my brother and also another friend of mine who I've known since school. So we'll be going out and doing that. So for lunch, we're heading to this place where my brother says they have like the best beef brisket egg noodle soup and I am super excited to try it because I haven't had much to eat today. Only thing I've eaten is a bowl of Milo cereal with some lactose free milk. So very excited to try it. Um, but I'll show you all what that food looks like when we get there. He says that every single person he's shown the food, they've loved it. So let's hope I'm not the first so one to not so like far. it. Yeah, we'll see, we'll see. Our hearts beating, I can't wait to kiss you each morning. So today has been a complete write-off because of my poor decision to stay up all night but I have now slept for quite a few hours this afternoon and I am feeling a lot better. So we're just about to head out for dinner because Junie is going to be treating me to some Korean food I think. We're going to be going out and we're just waiting for Melinda to finish walking. Charlie the chocolate lab slash retriever. It's not chocolate, it's black. Black Lab, yeah. X Retriever. But yes, more Charlie content over this vlog. Pretty chill day today. We're gonna just try to catch up with some friends maybe over the next few days. <laughs> Have you missed me? No. Why'd you come? <laughs> the Korean restaurant was closed, so we are now looking for a Mexican place because Junior is craving it and I'm just hungry now, so any food will be good food. Yes. Dinner and char time was a success. Into the car. <laughs> Yee! All right, I have done absolutely nothing today apart from just eat food and have some bubble tea, but that is okay. We are gonna go to bed very soon and start the new day tomorrow with a bang and hopefully get up to a bit more exciting stuff. So without further ado, time to hit the bed. Yee! Okay, bye bye. 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 So I've just dropped Junie and Melinda off at the airport and they will be coming back at around 5.30. It is currently about 8.30 so I've got a lot of time to kill. So the plan for today is to basically just house sit and dog sit and meet up with my friend, my old flatmate actually, Rosie, who you may know if you've seen my older videos. And so I'll be catching up with her at around 2 o'clock. But, you know, that still leaves a lot of hours in the day where I don't really know what I'm doing. But I think that's just something that we'll play by ear and figure out as we go. Come on. Hey, sit. Charlie, sit, sit. Hey. <laughs> you need to calm down. Uh, you are so lucky. So lucky. Ew.
Let's go. Alright, so I've been in Newtown for the past like 30 minutes or so. I've just had some lunch here, but now I'm off to meet up with Rosie, who I used to live with for the past like two years and then she moved up to Wellington. So haven't seen her in a hot minute, so it'll be good to catch up. But yeah, I don't know exactly what we're gonna get up to. We might head up to the wind turbines or something like that, but we'll just see what she says once we meet up. But I'm very close, so we'll see her soon. Welcome. Hello. We have decided to come up to the Brooklyn wind turbine. Yay. I was expecting there to be more than one, but apparently it's a singular wind turbine. But I've never seen one up and close, so this is a very exciting day for me. Are those in the distance? And true, yeah, there's heaps more behind us, but a wee while away. But the view up here of Wellington is stunning. And it was an absolutely terrible foggy morning today, but it has cleared up. And now this is what we can see. How nice. Oh, and that. My first time touching a wind turbine. <laughs> it doesn't seem to be generating much power at the moment though. Mm. Hardly moving. All right, once you're up here, there's not too much to do, but getting up here, I'm sure is the fun part by walking, but we were too lazy, so we drove up. And now we've been here for about 10 minutes and mm. we've done everything there is to do. We've read the signs that gave us information about it, touched the wind turbine, looked at the view. I highly recommend that you walk though. Don't be like us. But I think let's back to the car and we'll figure out something else to do. We're now checking out Ophiro Bay and I, it's my first time coming here as well. I haven't actually explored much of Wellington before, but it's good to be able to get out and check out these spots. It's quite choppy, but that is looking straight south. And then beyond that would be the South Island, but pretty cool. Pretty cool to check out this place. I think we're going to go for a wee drive along the bay and whatnot. And then hopefully by the end of that, that will be time for me to go pick up Junie and Melinda from the airport. But yeah, let's go look at some cooler spots around here. Yeah. Alright, so it's my third day in Wellington and we have an absolutely massive day ahead of us. We're just heading into town now. I need to take the train and then take the bus to get into Wellington City. And then I'm going to be meeting up with a friend and they're going to show me around Massey. After that, I'm going to be catching up with another friend. And then after that, going out for dinner with some other friends as well. So it's going to be a big day of catching up with friends I haven't seen in a while. But really looking forward to it and I'm excited for you to come along and kind of see what I get up to. So without further ado, let's not be late for the train. I've been knowing that we can't It's Robbie. Oh, I'm on the, the YouTubing now. Yeah. Oh my god. Bubble tea. I've been knowing that we can't dance. We need all our just to stay with you. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> this is Liv, everybody. Hello. That's Robbie, AJ, AJ and Hi. Holly. Show off your stump. <laughs> Great time seeing Bobby, AJ, and Liv. And now we are on our way back into town and then I'm going out for dinner with some other friends. So this has turned out to be an incredibly busy day, but well worth it. Meeting up with Hillary and Alex now and we're going to go out for some dinner. They've recommended a ramen place in Newtown, so pretty excited to try that out. But I am just trying to find their flat now and then we can go to dinner. So 
Fingers crossed I can find it soon because I am kind of hungry. No blueberries in my ice cream cake. No air to breathe with that masking tape. Stop me. I need a hostage free. I need a rocket ship. I need a run from I like no blueberries in my ice cream. Alright, so I've just finished having dinner with Hillary and Alex at BB Moss, I think it is. It was a super amazing dinner and it was super nice to catch up with all of them because I haven't seen them in such a long time. But now that brings us to an end of this really long, fun and fulfilling day. But I still do need to make it home. So the bus did say it would take about like an hour and a half to get there. And I didn't really want to stay out that much later. So I've asked for a favor from Holly and she said she's more than willing to drive me home, which is super, super kind of her. And so I'm just heading over to hers now so she can drive me home. But yeah, that pretty much brings us to the end of today. I don't think there's much else I'm gonna be doing, so I'll just see you all nice and early for tomorrow. So it's currently Thursday up here in Wellington, which means it is my last full day that I have up here. But unfortunately, the weather has taken a turn for the worse. So my original plans of going into town to film a POV photography video, which I've been meaning to do for quite a while, has been foiled. So I'm just planning on staying in today and maybe just enjoying Kind of chilling out because yesterday was such a big day and my legs are feeling kind of sore. So I want to just be playing with the dog, filming random bits here and there. I will be heading out to Lyle Bay with my brother later this evening to have a catch up with Robbie again. But yeah, I hope you enjoy watching me cook, do random things, play with the dog and everything else. But yeah, that's the fourth day here in Wellington. So let's go. This is my buddy for today. Look at that side eye. Wow, what's with the attitude, Charlie? What is up, YouTubers? We've just been having a, a dinner, a couple of chicken burgers, you know, doing it for the vlog. Journey, your turn. What? <laughs>